This problem asks you to solve the system of equations by substitution. We use substitution primarily when we already have something uh, y equals, which in this case both equations have y equals, so we definitely want to use substitution here. On this one, we're just going to take the first equation, which tells me y equals 3x plus 2, and we're going to set it in minus 2, and we're going to set it e uh, substitute that in for the y into the second equation. So the second equation we rewrite, instead of y, we write 3x minus 2. And then on the right side, we just leave it as x plus 2. We're not substituting anything for x. So now we have a way to find our x value of our solution. Remember, your solution is an x and a y value. So we just need to solve this two-step, or this uh, equation with variables on both sides. So we subtract x to get the variable on the left side. So it gives us 2x minus 2 equals 2. We're going to add a positive 2, such that the 2x is by itself. And then we're going to have 2 plus 2, so we're going to divide both sides by 2, so we get x equals 2. So the x value of our solution is 2. So then we go back up to one of the two original equations. It doesn't matter which one, and it should be in an original equation. We plug in 2 for x, and we go find out what y would have to be. So it's going to be 3 times 2 minus 2. Well, 3 times 2 is 6. 6 minus 2 is 4. So your solution is 2 comma 4 x equals 2, uh, y equals 4 would be your solution. After we go ahead and write down our solution, it's usually a good idea to check. That's one of the great things about these problems is you can always check your answer. So we go, go back to the first equation, uh, which we're going to call equation 1, and we plug in 2 for x and 4 for y, and we find out, does that point make the equation true? So 4 goes in for y, 2 goes in for x. So we end up with 4 equals, well, 3 times 2 is 6. 6 minus 2 does equal 4, so we know 4 equals 4. So that made it true. And then we do the same thing for the next one, which is very simple. Plug in 4 for y, 2 for x, 2 plus 2 obviously equals 4, so 4 equals 4. So we know that's the solution to our equation, system of equations.